Yes. And I wanted to talk about the hardest thing about living in the Dominican Republic for me. Yeah. Which has been the stares and the looks that we get. I was not prepared for that. I was not expecting that at all. And her, that she is a girl that don't really like people, like, look at her. Yeah, like, the attention. And, yeah. yeah, when I was in the United States, nobody looked at me, no one talked to me, no one bothered me. Like, I could go to the gym, I could go to the store, I could go for a walk with my dog, and nobody would talk to me, no one would look at me, pay any attention. I could just be in peace, and yeah. those days have gone. Right. Yeah. Because here, <laughs> no, it's not. But I just think that. As a whole, people here, they look at each other, they communicate with each other, like strangers. Yeah. Like, there are so many times when you just walk down the street and just talk to people. Yeah, people here are very... Friendly. Friendly. Yeah. And sociable. Yeah, so some of the stares and some of the looks are just normal. Yeah. It's just normal. Even here, uh, if it is not an American, if like between us Dominican, just Dominican, if somebody's new for me, I'm going to stare it. I mean, yeah, like look at them. You're yeah, curious. It's, I'm curious. Like, it's a new person. Yeah. But like, when it's uh, United States people or people from other country, yo, know, the attention is so much more, yeah. and the stares are so much more. Because, like, white. <laughs> is white so much white? Like, we don't have people so white like that. Yeah, so the reason that I think that people stare and people look at me so much is because of the assumptions and the perception that Dominican people have of Americans. Of Americans, yeah. Which is a lot. Which is a lot. Yeah. Are, yeah. And like, so, you know. when... Like, if we go to a village or we're driving a motorcycle in, like, a smaller village, children will just scream, yeah. American, American, <laughs> American, and they just see me and they see that I'm white and they just assume that I must be American, which I am, <laughs> but they just think that all white people are Yeah, Americans. are Americans. Yeah. A lot of people think that here. Mm -hmm. All right. Which is the next assumption, which is that most people assume that we are rich. Exactly. Because they assume that all Americans are All Americans are, are rich. rich. And many people here um, are like, I want an American. I want an American. Everyone here is like, one American. And when they, they see others, my case, <laughs> when they see others, like with Americans and Dominican with an Americans, they always say to the Dominican, "Hey, you're so lucky, man! Yeah. Uh, you got your visa." That is most. That that is, uh, the what people most of the time tell me. Which is the next assumption, which is that people just assume that Mariano got his visa because. I don't have it. We're together, <laughs> but he doesn't have his visa, and I want to live here. Yeah, I want to live here. here. But a lot of people, I think that's the most yeah. common thing that people say to us is, congratulations, you got your visa. <laughs> uh, yeah. I'd rather that they say, you got an American that got a visa. Yo. Yeah, it seems like you're just using me for my visa. Yeah. <laughs> but that's not true. No, of course not. <laughs> but but yes, yeah, a lot of... Dominicans want their visa yeah, to so. get to the United States. So, it's And even in our wedding video, I think you said of course. that you can hear. Yeah, I can hear somebody saying, very good, my <laughs> boy, you got your visa. <laughs> some people, some of my friends were like, Mariana, how long time without see you? I thought you were in the United States. <laughs> And uh, this title oh, you put. Oh yes, they just assumed that we were leaving and that we were moving to the United States when yeah. we got married. Uh huh. Uh, most of the men who get Americans here, the girls 
take the men to the United States. Yeah. And if it is a man, American men, then the American men take the, the women the to the woman United States. Yeah. Like, and people okay. have that in their mind. So it is common. Yeah. Okay. That's fair. But no. We don't have our visa. <laughs> yet. <laughs> and we want. Another assumption that people make, which really gets old, and I don't like this one, is that people think they can just steal me away mm. from Mariano. <laughs> and so, like, if we're walking down the street, they'll just shout, like, hey, be careful, take care of her, or I'll steal her away from you. I'm like, no! And even kids! And kids! How is a kid gonna steal me away? I would steal her. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that oh, one bothers me a little just because like I'm not an object yeah. to be stolen, oh. but when little kids say it, it is kind of funny. If anyone says it, it's funny. No one's going to steal me away. Oh yeah, but that's one of the assumptions that I don't like so much. I don't like it for any. Yeah. For any, because... Uh, Actually, the first time I heard that, I, I was scared a little bit. I was like, what? No. Well, it like puts that thought in your head, and I don't like that. Don't but it's, like it it's not true, and that won't happen. Never, ever. Never. God gave me that precious woman, and nobody will take it off. Won't Unless I it. die. But I would like to die first. I will die first. <laughs> I'm going to die today. today. Okay. Yes. The next assumption, which we heard yesterday from a complete stranger, mm -hmm. is that I'm loyal. Which is true. I am loyal. Of but course. he was just assuming that I'm loyal because I'm an American. And all the Americans for them are loyal. But yeah, I am loyal. So that assumption is accurate. Yeah. But he didn't even know me. <laughs> he doesn't know if I'm loyal or not. <laughs> the next assumption is that Mariano is the lucky one I because am. so many people no I so am. many people like if we're walking or if we're on the motorcycle even or if we're on the bus mm -hmm. wherever we are people will always shout and say oh hey look you're lucky man yeah. you're so lucky and I'm like no 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 <laughs> I am the lucky one I am the lucky one to have you so that assumption is not true <laughs> at all. So yeah, when we're walking, when we're on the motorcycle, people shout a lot of things at us. Mm -hmm. At least one person will shout every time we go somewhere. <laughs> I don't think there's ever been a time where no one has said anything to yeah. us. And it's not everybody. And do you remember but when, it's we a lot. Were, when we were driving, Wendy? Yesterday. So... Maybe. Dominicans are very resourceful. They fit a lot of people onto a motorcycle. <laughs> yeah. And a lot of we only people had, and things. We only had three, <laughs> which is a lot. But it was Mariano and then me and then Wendy, who was like our family here. Yeah. And so I was really, really close to Mariano. And also, I don't like the motorcycle. So I'm like squeezing him as hard as I can. And I'm like also hiding from the sun. So like I'm over here and then like Wendy's behind me on the back. And we stopped at a red light. I and a guy. Yeah. He was like, hey, your girl. Love you so much. <laughs> <laughs> because I was squeezing him so tight. Which I do love him so much, yeah, but then but... Mariana tells the guy that no, it's because I'm afraid <laughs> of the motorcycle. No, man, she's afraid. <laughs> so he was laughing at us. Yeah. And then we drove away. But yeah, a oh. lot of people just talk to us. So, like sometimes it's funny and sometimes it's okay. I mean, it's gonna happen for the rest of our lives. We might as well get used to it. Yeah. Uh, the sun is whoop. Yeah, the sun is coming. Yeah, it's good. I'm so white now. Okay, I'll move okay. back a little bit. A bit. Okay. And then the, the last thing that I wanted to say was sometimes police officers will say stuff. Oh, yeah. And it scares me so much. Scares you? It scares no. me. 
Like, because my, like my mask, get out of my okay, mask. Okay, yeah, because when we walk, it's hot. Okay, like yeah, we don't wear our mask. We don't wear our mask when we walk. And so, like a police officer would be like, "Hey!" And we're like, "Oh no! Oh no! I don't have my mask on." And you know what? What they say? <laughs> they say what? Take care of her. Take, take care take of your care girl. Of her, right? Take care of your beautiful girl. And oh. we're like, "Okay, thanks." <laughs> Oh my gosh. Yeah. yeah. It's hot. I'm not wearing my mask when I walk. And she's so beautiful. She combed that t-shirt a lot. Oh, but that really scares me when the police officer <laughs> says something. <laughs> you set up so fast. Okay. I don't want to get me there. So, it has gotten better. Because I think that people do recognize us now because I've been here for almost six months now and so like the area where we walk here mm -hmm. and in Consuelo people do remember us people do recognize us so like people don't make so many comments yeah and they don't ask us if we want to ride on the motorcycle anymore when we're walking <laughs> I don't think it'll ever go away we just have fun with it now we yeah. try to have fun with it we try <laughs> we try so the only way that I've been able to make it personally is by having my alone time with God every week. Yeah. Every Saturday or every Sunday. I've had to just be alone, sit alone with him. Because all week, everywhere we go, we, need, we have the attention yeah. of everybody. Yeah, we need to be very strong in God. That is all of the assumptions about americans here in the dominican republic and if you want to end a dominican i don't know pray a lot <laughs> <laughs> for that dominican be a person according to god willing yes i never wanted to, to marry a dominican <laughs> and look what happened a dominican <laughs> Yeah, so I wish somebody would have warned me about all of the looks and all of the stares. Not that it would have made a difference and I still would have moved here anyway. <laughs> but it would have been nice to be prepared for that. Yeah. So, that's all. Peace out. Peace out. I'm doing fine. So is your worried mind. Sit back and close your eyes. so very nice I'm happier than I've ever been